Okay, thank you very much, uh, Sister Tiragu, our good MC. Corporate, good afternoon. In front of you is Kenneth Tui, the Secretary General, or the person who takes after our great and mighty Evans Kidero. In front of you is I wish to introduce and congratulate you, dear comrades, for attending this auspicious occasion. Today, we, we are here today to represent the poor and the death of our great Evans Kidero. Indeed, it was not our wish that Evans Kidero could leave us, but I wish to tell you, comrade, that Kidero is alive today. He's alive to get you to it, comrade. Peaceful of uh, moments and uh, we are enjoying it. I wish to thank our administration for uh, providing some refreshments for us and these are very good. This council of 2022 2023 are not going to increase the salary of themselves, but they are going to increase the bus time. Comrades, Comrade, these are members who are uh, fully set to represent our needs and to present to, uh, what the centers need for this to do. Uh, at this juncture, allow me, comrades, uh, in respect to our late Evans Kidero, to say that uh, the seat that Evans Kidero owned at that time in 2018 was the seat of the Secretary General. Today, with you here is Ken Pitui, the Secretary General of Mary University 2022 2023, and as we are waiting for our visit to be with us in this uh, occasion, I wish to tell you that Ken Kipui is not a man who is fearful. Ken Kipui is not a man who fears death. Ken Kipui is not a man who was brought to office. But Ken Kipui is a man who dedicated his life to represent you, comrades. Comrades, today, you sent us into power to represent you. You sent us to be accountable. You sent us to be integral. And exactly that is what we are going to do. Uh, our presentation, we ascended into power. It is unfortunate, comrades. Comrade, I want to thank you and that our predecessors. I want to thank you very much for criticizing our government. But since you have started the criticization uh, moment, we want to say that uh, this government is ready and are willing and, uh, and will uh, cooperate with you so that they encourage you to continue criticizing this government. But before you criticize this government, please criticize our predecessors. They made a budget of 150,000 to amend the constitution. The constitution was not amended. We cannot budget another 150,000 to amend our constitution. So that to meet the interest of, uh, of, of those students in Marimba and those students in Tanukapa. We will amend our constitution and those who are before us, they will have to come to this money. We are not here, comrade. I want to remind you that I pay 500 shillings to some and also you, you pay 500 shillings to some. Congress, I want to thank you very much for listening to me and I know that uh, the money that was budgeted for last year will be used to amend the constitution this year. Otherwise, Congress, I know that uh, you are well set, you are aware of what is uh, taking place in this university. I wish... Okay, Congress, because of, because of the little time, allow me at this juncture to welcome our middle students. <laughs> I'm glad and happy today to be in the presence of our great Vice Chancellor, Mr. Uh, Professor Romana Santiago, uh, our DVC, our Dean, and uh, our esteemed comrades. Good evening. Good evening once again, comrades. Today we are here in commemoration of our great and our greatest team, uh, Mr. Evans Kidero, who left us in the line of duty. I'm very glad and happy that comrades have honored this day and attended this memorial service so in honor of our great Evans Kidero. Today, I hold the office of our departed one, Mr. Evans Kidero. In front of you, again, is Ken Kipui. Today, comrades, you have witnessed that there is in a picketing of our lecturers and I wish to tell you and in front of our administration that let this let this picketing not affect our academic calendar and let them uh, organize for our repeat classes, for the classes we have missed today. Comrades are here not to miss the classes, but they are here well represented and in the full glare of our administration to ensure that they attend all their duties and all their classes which was to be attended today. Comrades, I thank you very much and I thank you for not joining any other parties. 
but to be here in respect of our late Evans Kibero, who was a Secretary General. Once again, comrades, I want to thank you. And uh, before our great hero, Sir Evans Kibero, we said, legends don't die, but they rest in peace. 